What am I talking about, by the way? I thought it was a pharmaceutical uh, thing. Uh, Jeffrey Tambor's workshop, but what's the topic? Is it a, just an acting workshop? That's what you're interested in? Um, so um, uh, I can't, uh, can't think of a better year where uh, artists need to uh, really gird up and get it going, don't you think? Uh, you're in more need now. That, what the fuck is going on with these things? I feel, what am I, Princess Grace? Uh, I can't think of a better time or a better call, don't you think, for artists and actors and writers? Yeah? Uh, you can applaud. It's good. Um, you can actually applaud a little harder. Let's start off with that. Um, that's, the, uh, uh, that's the first thing you need to bring on to a set, is uh, energy. That's the very first thing that has to happen, is energy. And uh, if you can't applaud for yourself, then you can't applaud for your, for your actors, which you, uh, which you have to do. So here, here's the deal. This, we're going to have two actors who are really good actors come up and we're going to play with them, but that's not the point. The point is, is a confidence game. So you as a director need to give confidence to the actors and they need in turn to give confidence to you and if the writer is on the set he needs to give confidence to the whole thing and the whole deal is about confidence. Now I have two people who are shadowing me around while I'm here in Austin and they give me confidence. They say, you're going to be great, you're going to be good, and here's a tea, and here's a thing, and here's a fruit bar, and here's a bubba, and da, da. that's the beginning and the end of the deal. You've got to know. I know you want to talk about theory, and I know you want to talk about, you know, the great ideas of Descartes and uh, Hegel and all like that. It all begins with confidence. So you bring that on to the set. Uh, Orson Welles, so you should know. Um, anybody know Orson Welles? <laughs> Third baseman, Boston Red Sox. Great Orson um, he said, he used to have a, um, um, well, he said one of the great, one of the great reasons he was so successful was he didn't know anything. So he came on as an amateur every day. May you come onto your set as an amateur every day and not like a pro, you know, who knows all the answers. Because if you know all the answers, there's no reason to make the film. Is that correct? There's no reason, reason to even start. Because uh, I don't know is, start inching your way now, I don't know is much more powerful than I know. You got that? You're all looking at her and not me. <laughs> interesting. Um, and uh, the, the second thing is, um, if you have the, if, for you directors, if you have it in your head already, I urge you to drop that. Because the last thing you want to do is have this stillborn experience of you have it all in your head and you're not able to change. So I'm all about change. I'm all about fucking it up. I'm all about messing it up to find the real thing. So I'm all about rehearsal. Come on in. This is Jess. Give her a hand. And this is, uh, this is Mark. 